This video demonstrates how to easily replace an Autel MX sensor. Autel manufactures three types of 315 MHz and 433 MHz MX sensors. Bolt-in metal stem sensors, press-in metal stem sensor, and press-in rubber stem sensors. Now let's examine how to dismount and mount these sensor types. To dismount the bolt-in metal stem sensor, remove the cap, screw nut, and washer from the valve stem, and then remove the sensor assembly from the rim. To mount the sensor, slide the valve stem through the valve hole of the rim, with the sensor on the inside of the rim, and then, in order, put the washer, screw nut, and cap back on the valve stem. Please note, the washer, screw nut and cap must be assembled outside of the rim. If the washer is assembled inside the rim, the tire will lose air pressure. If the washer is not correctly assembled, the sensor will be too tight to dismount. Now tighten the sensor body with the stem while ensuring the sensor body lies flat on the rim. To dismount the press-in metal stem sensor, Remove the cap, screw nut, and washer from the valve stem, and then remove the stem from the rim. To mount the sensor, line up the sensor with the rim hole, and then, in order, place the washer, screw nut, and cap back on the valve stem. Connect the sensor body to the stem to complete the installation. To dismount the rubber stem sensor, depress the press button on the sensor body and carefully pull the sensor body straight back off the valve. Cut the rubber bulb and attach a standard TTV tool to the valve. Remove the valve from the rim by pulling the valve through the rim. To mount the sensor, line up the sensor with the rim hole and attach a standard TTV tool to the end of the valve. Pull the valve stem straight through the valve hole. Connect the sensor body to the valve stem. Please note, the valve's rubber bulb must rest against the rim. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or suggestions about our products, please visit our website or simply contact us.